Greetings everyone, and welcome back to SimCity Build It. As you can see, I have reached level 25, which means we're going to be able to open up a new region, and we are going to do that. I do want to go over a couple of things first, mostly having to do with the design challenges. There's one going now, but we just had the previous group of them end, and I did get my rewards. For instance, you can see this one down here on the beach. This is the pier shopping area. It looks really good. It kind of fits right in there, too. Uh, the big one, of course, was the castle, the round castle. It has a very nice little area there and a nice boost. It is on the edge of town, and I was trying to figure out how I could actually get it to cover more buildings. The thing is that I was looking at this area here around where this castle is, and I happened to notice that right next to it is this which is almost as good and a lot smaller, so I'm not going to be moving that anytime soon. I don't know, maybe I'll restructure things or something, because I do actually want to make some more changes in the future. See, here's the thing. I do have mountain items up here. Even just the train station is a 40% boost to everything in range, but there's nothing in range. I'm wondering if I want to relocate my uh, factories. I was thinking if I converted them into the pollutionless ones, I might want to put them on this edge of town over here and take these buildings and put them up near the mountain here. I actually already own this first area right outside, uh, right underneath the, uh, the mountains. The next one might be the one I would get. Let's see. I'm closing in on that. We'll have to see about that. I don't know. Um... Or I might want to push things over further. See, even if I do take care of the factories, I do have other issues. Like, for instance, uh, yeah, the sewerage. If you look at the sewerage, yeah, that's got kind of a wide area to it there. And I don't even think that's the bad one. Where is the big one? Oh, not that. Um, actually, are they over here? Ah, the garbage dumps. Yeah, they have a range there, too. So I would have to push over to the right, I suppose, in order to uh, be able to be free of those things. Okay, what is that? Oh, is that more? Okay, yeah, that's, um, hold it a second. Yeah, that's another garbage dump. Yeah, I mean, the thing about it is, I think I would need a lot of space over, and, okay, what did I just do? Cancel? No, I don't want to do anything like that. I don't know, maybe I'd have to push everything this way in order to put those things over there so I can build up there. I don't know. I'm going to need a lot more space for that. All right. Like I mentioned, there is a current design challenge. So why don't we just jump in here and take a look at the uh, the rewards. They got some cool things here. Uh, I like the idea of the shopping mall on the beach because that's a beach one. Uh, these, I believe, are parks and they have a night effect. I'm guessing they'll look good at night, but they are both parks. So that's interesting. Now, one thing I noticed when I cashed in from the last uh, exchange thing here, because this is going to go on for uh, four weeks, and I'm actually starting from the beginning this time, so I'm hoping I'm going to do better. I only got two of the buildings, but I did buy some other stuff. For instance, I noticed that I was now in the Gold League, and something new popped up there, which was pretty inexpensive, and that is the city storage items. Just 400 blueprints, and you get five of each. I mean, it takes six at this point for me to expand and i already have a couple of each so i mean that's a guaranteed extra storage right there so i mean basically every month if you do these events you can just get more storage so i like that of course i did have to get to the gold league for that and you can see i'm like right on the edge there but i mean i do have a uh, a new submission as a matter of fact that's exactly what i'm going to do right now so let's just pop right in because i already have rivertown ready to go I did want to make one last change here, and we're going to try to hide the fact that I have half bridges going on. Uh, I wanted to make this last building big because it kind of stands out a little bit, so let's just uh, spend some vegetables on that. Now, I've already, like I said, I've already fulfilled the requirements here. I got the minimum population, obviously. Everything is covered with services. I have... Uh, the buildings this time are both landscape, so I have 10 landscape plots, and everybody's covered by landscape, and I have a minimum 15,000. Actually, it's about to go up there, too. Not yet. Yeah, these other ones, I would really like to have done the trailer park over here, but it's a little on the expensive part. The, uh, the drinks, 
they're a little bit annoying and uh, I'd like to hold on to the one that I'm making right now. All right, let's let this one finish here and then we will submit it. I'm going to get the full 300 from this and then hopefully I'll get some good ratings and uh, I'll, I'll uh, get more of them. Uh, what I've been doing in recent times is I've been basically putting the services in the middle and building around it. So I have a fire department there and I have a police department there and then I have health and then I have he oh, health on the end there too. So basically as long as people stay within this range here, I mean I could have expanded this one here out a bit um, if I needed to, but I didn't think it was a good idea. Okay, that is just going to have to move, isn't it? Because it's a little weird. There we go. Hold on a second. Right, because those guys weren't really aligned up very well. As a matter of fact, I happen to notice that this one is suffering from the same problem. Can I get that to rotate a little bit? Is that going to do? Right, okay, they're a little bit different on the colors, but they got the same shape going. All right, so 17,900. All right, and I actually did want to wait until night. Uh, the thing about it is I don't think there's any way that I can hide the fact that the bridges just kind of stop. It is giving me some good stuff, though. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to submit. All right, and then we have to arrange it here a little. There's not much I can do about that. All right, we're just going to do that. I think it looked good at night, so punch it. All right, so I got the 300. So hopefully I'll get some good ratings and I'll get more. All right, so... That's just the beginning, of course. I have a lot of things in here I want to get, and none of those are things that I want. Uh, I would like to get all of the buildings. Uh, barring that, the first and the third I would like to get. And, of course, I'm hoping I have enough that I can get the city storage items. But that would be after everything else. Making the city look good, that's what it's all about. Okay, and apparently I got an achievement for that. Uh, what is this one? Submit 10 design challenges. Oh, okay. Oh, two more donuts and I'll get some money. More donuts is good. All right, so we're done with that. Uh, another thing that popped up when I hit level 25, which was interesting, was I can now get uh, buildings that are associated with gambling. And I couldn't help but notice that a lot of them were very inexpensive. All right, let's take a look here for a moment here. Like, Gambling HQ, if you look at that one, that's just money. But they usually make one of them easy to get. But if you look at these other ones here, look, that one is just three gold coins. Oh, pardon me, keys. That's five. And I guess maybe they're just not open yet. Maybe it's the fact they're not unlocked yet. Or maybe you have to do the first one. Right, you have to do the first one in order to unlock the other ones, right? But I noticed something here way on the end. Way on the end. Yeah, these guys here, these are actually kind of interesting. I mean, these are upgradable, and they seem to use a different currency. The currency that's at the top. You notice it's also saying regional population. I think this has to do with what we're going to be doing, opening up another region. A lot of these actually in the same apartment here. As a matter of fact, the currency they use is from that. For instance, you can see at the top of the screen... To the uh, left of the, the platinum key up there, we have this, which is a regional currency. So I'm guessing that's what we're going to be doing when we open up a um, our new region, which we should probably get to, shouldn't we? All right, so if you look at the bottom of the screen on the left, you'll notice that there's a little red dot, so we're going to click on that. All right, I guess we have to pick one. The one that looks good to me is the one that's just to the left of the capital city, the one with the island in the middle. So I don't know if it just unlocks when I click on it or I get to look at it because I just want to preview it for a moment here. Because it does let me use bridges. That's what I'm thinking in terms of. I would rather have seen it empty. Just, just me. But I would rather have seen it empty. That way I could just think about what I'm going to do with it. And it's not letting me do anything. I can't scroll it or anything. Oh, well, I guess that's it. It is a lot of space, though. So I think that's the one I'm going to unlock. 
I don't know if I'm going to be able to unlock others in the future. Maybe I have to get to like level 30 or something like that. But yeah, that's the one I'm going to do. All right. So Green Valley. Okay. Welcome to Green Valley, Mayor. It smells so clean and fresh. Are you saying something about my city not smelling clean and fresh? People here want to make things stay that way, so uh, get to know their needs to build the city of your dreams. Okay, don't worry. Coal fire plants are really great for small towns. Believe me, you'll love them. Okay, so what do we have here already? What is this? Regional exports. Okay, I can't unlock that until I get more people. I'm just trying to identify. Okay, so that's my trade depot. Okay, I guess this... Oh, this is assignments. All right, but this is the same as the one on the outside. So do they both apply? And what do we have over here? Okay, and that's the global trade. Okie dokie. All right, so am I building over here? I guess I am, because I can see the little things here. Can I get beach items? Can I just build on all of these? Wait a minute. Here we go. Uh, if I click on this. Oh, I need to do the expansion things then. Ooh, okay. All right. I'm guessing then I'm going to have to... Uh, well, I don't have any currency for this. I guess I'm going to be spending my regular currency. All right. So let's just see how this works out. Green Valley Zone. Okay. Is that going to turn into a skyscraper? Because I want it to be a skyscraper. All right, I guess we have to start putting these down then, right? But that probably means I'm going to need to get other things too, right? Here, just put, for now, we'll just put two of them down there. All right, so what am I going to need to build these? Okay, what is that? Uh, you'll need to use local goods to upgrade Green Valley residential zones. Uh, you can get them from the Green Factory and the Echo Shop. Okay, I don't know what exactly what that means. I'm guessing it's the, the second item here. All right, I'm not sure. Oh, oh, I have to build the store. Okay, the Echo Shop. All right, can I put that like somewhere over here for now? And I can upgrade that. All right, hold on a minute. Okay, these regional products like the recyclable bags can be used to upgrade local residential zones. All right, but that's not what... Oh, that's what I'm looking for. Okay, but I need a factory then to make those? I'm a little confused. All right, so where is... Okay, it's telling me to make a factory. A green factory. All right, so why don't we just... I'm guessing it doesn't have a pollution area to it then. Okay, new production unlocked. Okay, so this one probably produces this. Okay, recycle fabric can be used to upgrade residential zones in this region as well as raw material for other regional products. All right, how long is that going to take? That's going to take six minutes. Okay, it already... Oh, wait, I might as well just do this. Uh, I don't suppose you're going to give me the opportunity to watch a video because I will watch that video and not sit around for six minutes waiting. All right, so I got a whole bunch of that stuff. You know, I might as well just start it working on some more because, I mean, it's the only product I can actually make at the moment. And I think we should probably just make at least one of these. That's going to take 20 minutes, though. All right, hold off on that for a moment because I might need these things. All right, so I need other products here. All right, I need wood, and then I need plastic and metal. All right, so we're getting out of here. We have to go back home. I can't put any more. Okay, what was this? It looked like I could put something else down. It was giving me a one, and I'm not seeing it here. Yeah, it's just giving me a one. All right, well, let me put another one of these houses down. I mean, is it going to ask for police and fire and health? I guess maybe once they're built, they'll do that. All right. For now, we just want to build them. We can always move them around, right? All right. I need to get back home. Is it? Do I have to use this to switch back? All right. We'll switch back to the capital. 
because I need to do some uh, production here, don't I? All right, let's get over here. So I needed metal. I need wood. All right, let's do this. And I'll put the wood in here. I need a plastic too. And there's the plastic. All right. Okay, switching back to Green Valley. All right, so I can build those. So let's do that. And then... Okay, regional currency. Leaf simoleons are used as currency exclusively in the Green Valley. You can earn them by upgrading buildings in the Green Valley and may spend them to buy regional services here. Okie dokie. And then there's this one. Okay, what does that last one need? Oh, a hammer. Okay, we're getting complex now. I think I'm going to have to make a cross street here or something because I'm running out of room quickly. All right, hold on a minute. Uh, this one here. Oh, no, no, no. Straight, please. All right, and we'll do this. And uh, can I just send this one here? All right, can we just do that? There we go. All right, that will do for now. How much do I need for this? Five each. All right, so that means I'm not going to really be able to expand my own place very much. All right, that needed a hammer. I think I have hammers in construction at the moment. I kind of used them in the design, uh, the design phase here. All right, what is your problem? Right. I can put another one down. I mean, I'm guessing I should be going exclusively with the Green Valley Zone residences here. I don't know if I should be doing other ones. I can see I can do that. I mean, do I want to build up to the office buildings thing? I don't know. We'll have to see. All right, what do you know? Oh, we can do that. All right, let's build that one. Oh, and immediately I can do this. Okay, and did we just unlock something? Oh, that counts. Okay, well, I'll grab that. I guess I'm going to be doing a lot of that one then, since we're going to be starting from scratch here. Oh, and it looks like I have advanced in terms of the current Easter event. Gold keys. How many gold keys? Can I click on that to see without hitting the button? Wait a minute. Three. Oh, oh, there's a reason for that. Because I happen to notice that there was a uh, assignment here for three gold keys. So let's go over here. Let's click on this because I think that's going to give me the chicken park, right? All right, going back and grabbing that. And that's going to get me the chicken park. And what is that one? The 10 by 10, 20%, probably small anyway, so it'll work out. Hold on to that. We'll put that next to the llama. All right, so I think we're done with that. What else do we have down here? Upgrade homes and design challenge. Now you tell me that. I just submitted my design. Ugh. That's, uh, that's irritating. Okay, hopefully it hangs around for a while. All right, so what do we need here? Oh, the hammer and... I probably have that wood by now. All right, let's uh, head on back to the capital. Yes, I do have that wood. All right, so let's grab that wood and let's replace it. I think I have a hammer available. Um, fortunately, it doesn't seem to be ready yet. You need nails? I got nails. Oh, and they have this special building for now, this chocolate factory. I am going to be very happy to see this go away because the design challenge was filled with a lot of, like, get three of these, get two of these, and uh, some of them are kind of costly, like that. That's, that's actually kind of costly. So I'd be happy to see that go away. Yeah, unfortunately, everything is stuck behind the uh, ladder there, isn't it? I mean, I could speed it up, but I don't think it would really matter that much. So we're not going to be able to work with that one. Uh, when I get the hammer, I'll advance that one a little bit. 
All right, so let's head back because I know we can advance one of them. All right, and let's see. Yes, seven. All right, my population is up to 222. We're about to get a boost. Okay, so we have... Uh, people are not happy because of services. So we're going to have to do something about that. All right, let's see what services we're missing, which, by the way, is a lot. Um, right, I have to buy that with that the local currency, though. No, I can use my regular currency. All right, let's just put this somewhere for now. Um... It has to be, yeah, it has to be attached somewhere. Okay, so we got the water. We're not having any other problems? I guess not. Oh, no, 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 I don't want to do that. Don't want to do that. All right, why don't we just grab these because I have a feeling we're going to need them. And we'll just keep the factory going. All right, what do you want? You want a lot. Oh, the bag. Uh... I mean, it was going to take 20 minutes to do, but I guess I might as well start working on that, right? I mean, yeah, two of them. I'll just do one. Like I said, it's going to take 20 minutes. Not much I can do about that. I can put two more down, which is probably what I'm going to do. Yeah, we're waiting for the hammer on that one. All right, and we'll put the, the green one down here, and then we'll put another green one over here. All right, can I do any of those? All right, this one, oh, like I said, uh, the Easter thing. I just want it to go away. Okay, I need uh, nails. I, do I have the nails? I think I do. It's just that that's kind of expensive, but they're just going to get expensive. There's not much I can do about that. All right, three more nails. I think I have been producing nails. So clearly this is going to be an endeavor. All right. All right. I'm just going to be proactive about this and start making more nails. You can never have too many nails if you're doing construction. So yeah, I have the farm one up here. As soon as the, uh, the chocolate one is done, I guess I have to move that up out of the way as well because it is kind of covering up the one next to it. It's like impossible to click on that without getting this one unfortunately i have to do this because yeah i have a requirement for that and that's going to take an hour and 15 minutes all right let's see nails i can do a bunch of nails so let's get the nails flowing and one more i'm probably going to need metal now all right let's uh head on back over here at least it's a quick time transfer. All right, so let's get this one going. I'm getting a lot of those red gems, so I'm advancing the Easter mission there. Okay, we're up to 332. All right, what do you want? Yeah, the bag. Nothing I can do about that. It's being made. Uh, I'm working on that one, and this was the hammer, right? Can I add another one? Yes, I can. Let me see. Uh, I guess I could put one over here. Uh, Green Valley. Oh, we can do that one. Okay, yeah, not a problem. Yeah, at some point it's going to start asking me about services. Okay, we're up to 338. So I'm making money, which is a good thing. Oh, I can make another house. I might as well just keep throwing them down as long as I can. The more that's there, the more is a chance I can actually do something. Oh, wow, we can actually watch a video here, too. Hey, maybe I'll get that item. Right, looks like I got a water problem, too. Okay, come on, give me the bag. Ooh, that works good. That means I can um, upgrade. Right? First of all, we need more water. Oh, 
Okay, which one was asking for the bag? Oh, I need wood for this one. Was that the only one that was asking for the bag? Oh, I need the, the basket of eggs, too. Ugh. Yeah, maybe I should wait until the, uh, the Easter event is over. Oh, I can get more of those. All right, as soon as this is done, I can open that one. But I do need to get some wood. So we'll just very quickly pop back and get wood. So more upgrading and more building to be done here. And since it's green and they want to keep it that way, I'm guessing that uh, we're going to be very limited. Um, I don't think any of those will grow up to be uh, skyscrapers or anything. Who knows? Maybe they'll be green skyscrapers. All right. So let's grab that and refill. You know, I might as well just grab metal because you can always use metal. Metal's just very useful. All right. Back over here. All right, and let's upgrade that one. Okay, and it looks like I got another reward. We'll wait for this one to be built so we can see how big our population has grown. 442. Oh, and I got these, which means... Yeah, I'm, it can only produce one thing, so I might as well just let it go. Uh, right, this one right here. Okay, what is that? Let me let me check on that in a moment. Oh, and somebody is unhappy. Power. All right, we need more power. Uh, yeah, I don't think they're going to like the coal plant thing. Yeah, probably not. All right, so let's see. Where am I going to put this? I'll put it over here for now. Yeah, I don't think green-wise they want the coal power plant. No. They probably want the solar one, right? Is that it? We still don't have enough power? Okay, hold on a minute. Let me extend the road. Oh, this one. Hello? Oh, no, no, no. I'm trying to, I'm trying to scroll it, but it's not letting me. Hold it. First things first. Like this. And back to here. Yeah, actually, it's not what I wanted. I wanted the road. Like that. All right. And then let's put another wind power farm over here. Okay, I think we've done that. And then let's do an upgrade here. Oh, you want my corn. Uh, the corn is expensive. All right, let's see. What do we got in here? Okay, upgrade residential zones. Okay, and do I have another one? Oh, my goodness. I have been doing some serious upgrading here. Area items. How many? Yeah, this is going to fill my inventory. You know, I should probably just spend them now and upgrade where I am. Let's just take a quick look at that. I guess we can move towards the the shore there, right? How much is this one? Five? I mean, that kind of makes sense, though, doesn't it? All right, I'm just going to do... Oh, you know what? No, I don't want to do that yet. Because I want... There's probably... There's probably a thing here for expanding. Expanding the beach. No, there is none. Oh, that's terrible. If I complete any of these, it'll probably be the next one that comes in. So there's no expanding of the city. Oh, well, always check before you do something like that. All right, let's just do it. All right, so now I own this. And I got another video. Well, the last one was useful. What is this? Export HQ now open. Okay, so what does it do? You can start packing the exports any time orders are available. Complete one or more rows before time runs out. Um, I'll get to that later. I don't think, considering I'm working on building right now, it's probably not something I uh, want to do yet.
Okay, so can I upgrade any of these? Uh, hammer. Okay, so I need multiple hammers now. Uh, yeah, that's right. And I'm waiting for that one. And another hammer. And what do you got? How many of those do I need? The baskets. Okay, I need the basket of eggs there. I need three basket of eggs there. If the event ends, are those going to change? Because uh, that's just kind of silly if it doesn't. And I need hammers. And I can't put anything else down. This is telling me I can put a store down, though. Oh, no. It's telling me that I can upgrade. Okay, so for 25000 I could speed it up by 10%. Uh, I'll get back to you on that one. That doesn't seem like a great deal. Just saying. There we go. Yes, it's a wonderful environment. Oh, and the bridge is already here. I thought I was going to have to build the bridges. Yeah, but I'm going to have to own this part right here. Nine? Nine each? Wow. How about this one? Well, that's only three. But, I mean, it means you can't move towards the bridge, which means you can't grab any of this. Wow, that's expensive. All right, well, I do need that currency coming in if I'm going to... Uh, Build some gambling buildings that uh, can be upgraded over time. All right, so this is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. It is going to be an extra thing to pay attention to. And, of course, if you want to expand, yeah, nine, it's going to be uh, kind of expensive. I think the area that I have now will be good enough to play with. But, um, yeah, I'm going to need some items from there, including this, uh, the eggs. I'm just going to wait for that one to go away. This one here, you know, you need a building to begin with. So, all right, let's just head on back and see what we can do in the uh, the store there. You know what I didn't look at? I should have clicked on another region just to see what it was going to cost. All right, hold on a second here. What do I need? Oh, I need some of the... I didn't realize I didn't have any more of that. All right, let me grab the seeds. And then we'll put this in here like that. Now, I had two uh, factories working on seeds because seeds are kind of important. All right, I got, the, um, I got that there. In some cases, they're expensive too. Like, for instance, uh, one corn requires four seeds. But I need minerals for that now. Hold on a second. Let me get the minerals. Uh, do, 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 minerals... Yeah, I'm just going to spend them all on the uh, the corn. Right, this way, this way. There we go. One, two. All right, and I think that that's probably going to be it for today. So we opened up a new region. What happens if I click on another one? Oh, does that mean I have to get 15,000 people in the first one that I unlock in order to... Um... Okay, that's fair enough. That tells you you have to work the region in order to open up another one. Okay, why are you giving me... Oh, okay, are you complaining that you don't have health care? All right, let me just grab this stuff for now. Let's just do this, too, because apparently I need this stuff. Uh, but they're not complaining about health care yet. I have a feeling they will be fairly soon. It's a matter of, I think, once the population reaches a certain amount, that's when they're going to start complaining. And I'm going to have to put them down, along with a police department and a fire department. You know, people are just very selfish. They don't like the idea of their houses burning down, you know? They should have compassion for others. All right, and I think, like I said before, that's going to be it for now. So we have a new region. We have to build that one up in order to unlock another region. And it is something else to work with, too. So, I mean, I really can't do any expansion here. Um, I just did spend a bunch of my expansion stuff there. So, yeah, that's uh, going to be a while. I mean, if in the design challenge I can get into the Platinum League, that would be very nice. Uh, I have found, though, that there's a bit of fickleness going on. See, when I submitted my design, here, hold on a second here. 
Uh, let's just take a look at this is what people are going to see. Oh, wow, that's great. They're not going to see that my bridges are like not connected. I have seen some really amazing designs that people submitted and they had like a 2.5 rating, whereas I've seen something else where it really didn't look very good. And the people were like 75 percent happy because they didn't have services. And that one had like a 4.0. It's really hard to judge. Uh, basically, you know, just submit, even if it doesn't look good, who knows, maybe it's going to be put against somebody who really doesn't look good, or they just prefer yours for some reason. One way or another, you're going to get some stuff. I mean, my results here, look, the last one I put in there was a 2.5, but I still got a bunch of the uh, blueprints, right? And this one has a 3.0. I mean, if you look at them, I follow like the same kind of pattern there. It de It depends. Sometimes... People just rate them up. I mean, it looks very similar to the previous one. And then this is a 3.5. And yeah, I mean, doesn't that look familiar? It's the same design. See the services in the middle and such like that? But sometimes you'll just get a good rating for it. I have no explanation. There's another 3.5. See the services in the middle? There you go. It's just, it looks nice because it's all snowy and such. So, I mean, if you play this game... Just put something up and then submit it. You never know. People might just rate you good for it. But you need those blueprints. And you need to go up in rating. With the Gold League, I can do upgrades to my storage now. If I get the Platinum, it'll be a lot easier to expand. Anyway, that is finally going to be it for now. So I'm going to be working on this. If something comes up in the meantime, we can do another video. I'm kind of looking for new things to do. We do have the uh, gambling buildings, but, you know, placing the gambling buildings really isn't uh, an amazing type of thing. But, um, oh, and no, that's not what I wanted to do. And no, that is really not what I wanted to do. I wanted to get rid... I wanted to... Yeah, this thing, I consider this thing to be a complete waste because it doesn't give you anything, right? I was thinking if you get there, it would give you, like, the little speed-ups. It doesn't give you anything. Just a complete waste. I wish I could just remove that. So that's going to be it for now. So if you like the video, please give it a like. Maybe say something in the comments for the Great God algorithm. And of course, subscribing is a great way to show your support. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See ya.